does it. So I'm gonna phrase it, Ed Dib your cunt. I, lo- I love Ed Dib your <laughs> it's, it's honestly the best trio of cunts. Dip cunt. <laughs> dip, dip cunt. I reckon that's what they, you know, like the whole like scouts, like. That's the thing. Because when I was in the scouts, yes. they were every every day. My dad had made the classic joke of oh, dip, dip, dob, dob. <laughs> but like we ne- we never really did any of that that stuff. I think if we ever did do any of that. Sorry, stuff, what is dip, dip, dob? I, 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 that's the problem. I don't know. I didn't do scouts, so I don't know what that is meant to be in reference I, to. I don't get it. Oh, okay. <laughs> so if your dad just having a stroke. <laughs> <laughs> but I reckon he, if they changed the joke to if dib dog oh, shit, oh, shit. <laughs> I'd have found that much if more dib dog cunt. I might have been like, you know what? <laughs> so, well, then, no. honestly, uh, Big Nigel's humour uh, needs a bit of working out, to be fair. I miss the scouts. I'm, I've, I've, always, I've always said, if, you know, I find, find the time, I'd like to go back and, like, yeah, you know, yeah, help, help the other side. Because I, I genuinely feel like... It's, it's like a very like rewarding and like growthful experience. I say that it's like a really rewarding and growthful experience. <laughs> uh, I'm currently 20 years old, uh, sat, <laughs> sat on the mouth sofa, about to record a mediocre at best podcast. Hello and welcome to I'm the mediocre at best podcast. No, I, I feel like I've... <laughs> I feel like I've got like the timing right for these like. Oh yeah. shit! Hello, I'm oh, being shit. the third early test getting away. I'm Fraser, 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 all of them, by the I, way. I feel I, I just it's kind of like my role that I've undertaken is to just it is it is to be the lead into the coolness and I yeah. just I just kind of enjoy no, it. No, it works. It really does work. Yeah, no. We're almost to fifty, James. Oh, the, 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 what the fuck? This is the the, the big phase. Yeah, this is the big yes. big act that we're gonna. We really... made it to fifty episodes. That is mental. Got like, two more, and there'll have been like an episode for every week in a year, even though we'll have been going for over a year, but it still sounds kind of cool to just go with me here. No, that, that, that sounds really cool. Like, 52, we should have taken the special for 52. No, I'm joking, we're not going to take the special for 52. That's, I don't know if I'd even count this as a special, really. I would count this as a special. We're trying to make it a special. Tired we're going to think it's a special. Might have made you click on it, but it's not. Uh, and then they'll just... immediately click off when I go with scout based banter. <laughs> as the opening. And my limb. The preamble. <laughs> the preamble. Because it's your limb bug. Because it's half ten in the fucking morning. Uh, no, <laughs> this is the. Uh, this might be the earliest we've recorded a podcast. This is mental for us. Why are we doing yeah. <laughs> it? Get um, it done. Well, we should get it turned up. Well. <laughs> Uh, so story time. Oh, I decided to go to the shop this after this morning. Why? Because I didn't have any beans. I ordered beans on toast. <laughs> and I didn't have beans or toast. That so is the lead bad yeah. mentality. I was just like, I don't that have beans or lead. toast. I really fancy a beans on toast. I could have gone to Londis. I'm not paying Londis prices. Like, you know no. what? I'm just going to go to. So you just pay the petrol to go to Asda. <laughs> but James, you know what they sell at Asda? What? They sell at Asda. Sell private Asda. <laughs> now because I went at half eight in the morning. There were four full crates of Prime on the shelf of the Meta Moon. Oh, fucking Meta Moon! Yeah. I, I was like, I'll have a little look. Four full crates of Meta Moon. Good. I was like, well, I've got a fucking oh, grab a bottle of Meta Moon. Moon. So, uh, the flavour's so good they can't describe it. And the Apparently bottle's it's different. Yeah, the bottle is... Which I'm not a fan of. Where's your branding? JJ. This one looks more like a penis. It, <laughs> I think it's the accentuation it's little, yeah, of the. It really is. Yeah. It's, 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 if, it's you a, got, if that bit was still like the same. It, it's, it's a girthy penis. It's a, let me it's tell a, you. I wouldn't complain. What? <laughs> bloody hell. If someone stuck a meta moon up my ass, <laughs> I would be bloody bloody. There's your life lesson. <laughs> There's your life lesson. Stick a meta moon up your ass. You can fuck the nerdy Brit if your cock is a meta moon. <laughs> JJ, if you're watching. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, wait, so, 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 so this is brand is like the flavour they can't describe, right? But it's just some... candy fruit. It says, "Oh, brilliant." That's rank. <laughs> Have you even tried it yet? It just says candy fruit flavoured. Oh, brilliant! It doesn't feel candy good. fruit. Isn't fruit sweet enough, dickhead? Oh, oh, oh no, oh no! It's almost powdery. <laughs> like it's that. You, it, it, I think I'm just drinking crushed up fucking. Dusty sweets. I'm not the biggest fan of that. Weirdly, I don't mind it. Weirdly, that is linking to some kind of childhood sweet, and that isn't awful. See, growing up, I never liked those sort of sweets. So for me, this is actually rank. 
I think I think I can comfortably say that's my because let's let's go through our prime history, kids. <laughs> okay. 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 Um, but by the the, the the white on black does also is also really oh, cool. It works. Really cool, so yeah. branding wise, it works, especially it better than the kit. tipped penis. Yeah. Um, so we've tried blue raspberry, lemon, lemon lime. lime, the mangoey KSI very new one, and, and that one, and we both have a, have a, tro- a red tropical, tropical fruits and then to what's try. The, what's the end of we haven't had after that? So we haven't had orange. grape, we haven't had orange, and we haven't had ice pop. Oh yeah, yeah I'll pop um, and obviously, whenever the energy drinks come in, we haven't had any of those. Oh, that's because I can. I can both comfortably say, I think that's my least favourite. Yeah. Then, then again, I'm not wild on blue raspberry. Blue, I that, think my favourite was weirdly maybe lemon lime or the KSI one. Yeah, what I said about the KSI one was that I think in terms of flavour, it's my favourite. But because Sorry, the, U, yeah. the UK don't really do lemon lime things. Because like the, the KSI one was just, just a mango, mango yeah. monster, basically, but without the caffeine. So but the lemon lime, it's, lemon lime was a bit different. Mm. Uh, blue, yeah, blue raspberry was this. This is my least favourite. Uh, but I like the. But compared to the KSI brand in last one, which is like black on black, which doesn't look good. That's I think the best brand. That looks really cool. And I love the like, the stars in the products. I think I Where think they the have brand? made a mistake because I think this might go a bit businessy. But I don't really give a fuck. No, go on. Um, I think. What they've basically gone is, we can't describe this flavour, so we're going to call it Metamoon. But in terms of a, we literally can't describe what it tastes like. I think there was a way to go with this, where if they suddenly managed to get the right formula for, for a drink that just tasted amazing. But not, like... Because the, because the problem is, you immediately kill the hype. If you have a drink called Metamoon, it's so good, we can't mm. describe it. And then most people drink it and go... It's like a it's like, not great. Yeah, that's bad marketing. Because immediately people go, "Oh, I'll try it then." Yeah, well, you can't throw it. The first tip I had was, like, "Oh, it tastes like there's like love hearts, part of that sort of vein of sweet." So I, to be fair, yeah. though, if and they oh, have described it because it's a freaking candy fruit. So obviously, if you know, like America, um, do, do Americans have love hearts? I think that's a UK thing. Oh, but imagine a love heart prime. Oh, that'd be. I I'd think be, that could. I mean, all of because that's that's very niche flavour. But they should do that if like really fucking niche prime flavor. I reckon, like, I can be like the Eddie Hearn of prime. The Eddie Hearn of prime. I'll 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 make some deals like you know we'll we'll, we'll get some love. We have Palmer Vibe. No, we don't get Palmer Vibe. That's one going. Cause that'd be shit. Yeah. Um, there, no, but there are some people who will watch this that will be really like, oh my god, a Palmer Violet's flavor. Yeah. That'd be cool. You're weird. That is strange. Palmer, Palmer Violets themselves are awful. fine. But if you want to drink, can't, can't get palm violets. Yeah, it's how people get like palm violet milkshakes. Mm. Like, give it over. Just give get it over. a life. Get get some entertainment yeah. inside of you. Are you eighty five? Well, get a meta mood inside hey. of you. In more ways than one, apparently. Oh god. Oh god. Uh, sound, sound excited, friends. <laughs> there's, there's a meta mood in you. Uh, so what? The, I feel like we should go with the plan for today's episode because it's it's like it's not a waffle. It's not a it's kind of theme. It, it's it's a mess. It's a Let's mess. Let's be honest, it's going to be a mess. Therefore, it's very mad. Yes. Um, cause, okay, the thing is, we've done 50 episodes. Like, we'll talk about, like, I, I've put together like a, a top 10 moments mm. from the past 50 episodes we'll react to. Um, but I guess just talk about, like, because for me... It's the mess. history of man. Because, <laughs> I mean, in the first episode, we did delve into, like, how it came about. Yeah. But I don't know whether we do that again as a quick, like... We can do that again. If people are new and haven't been I think there are also a lot of... That far. I think this is a nice little... You know when you do a game, right, and there's like like some games where you like get past a certain point and they'll never make you reset beyond yes. that point? I feel like this is a good point to go, these are some of the things that have, you know, we've done, haha, that was shit, that's never happened again. Okay. Like, and yeah. like, like, like we little, want to keep, like, want to do it some like, like We a, could actively go through some episodes and go, yeah, that was a bit of a stinker, guys, I'm yeah. sorry. Sure. I'm, to be able, just get the, like... On mm. channel, yeah, just go through our yeah. pods, what do we think of each one. Talk about some old, you know, Let talk me. about how, why the drink segment has practically died. Um, <laughs> we say as we just drink some fucking talk about noon. Talk about how the life lesson segment has kind of died. Uh, uh, life lesson for this week. Method. Life lessons haven't died. Well, the thing is... We're just too, we just forget them sometimes. I don't think, because I, I'd say on our, I think more than, more often than not, in a episode, we will say, there's your life lesson. We just don't write them down. 
Yeah. So every episode has a life lesson. So basically... Each... I just couldn't tell you what the life lesson was for episode 48. Because obviously by the thousandth life lesson, because this podcast is definitely getting to a thousand episodes, yeah. basically it's it's a fan's job to go through all... Because obviously we'll have yeah, tons of fans a by, the, by the thousandth this... episode. Um, on r um, slash media for best, people can go... <laughs> Okay, I don't want to be that cunt. Can you imagine? I'm having a fucking Reddit. <laughs> that would be sad. That would be blink. If we get to that level, I think. We oh, I don't think I've start. ever. I don't. I don't. I just don't go on Reddit. Like, occasionally, right? You will Google a question, and, the... and it and it will be a Reddit sub. Mm. Reddit. I'm so old. Um, <laughs> a, a, a Reddit sub. I, I'm li- I literally for a person who runs like multiple YouTube channels. I know fuck all about technology. Like, oh, literally, uh, I'll, I'll let you in on a little secret. So I just uploaded the second episode uh, of uh, my, my, my new podcast, yeah, the Memory Repair Podcast, Doctor Who content, um, with uh, the lovely Farries. Thank you very much for coming on, son. He's not watching. He's definitely not um, But basically, because we had a couple of technical difficulties and we had to just do it as like an audio podcast, I spent so long, because I only recorded... Basically, I made the mistake of recording audio with a blank video. So it was just a dark background. Right. And then the editing software that I still use, because I'm too fucking lazy, you can't cut audio. Okay. You can't, you, you can't what, detach you can't an audio and a video audio. file. Okay. So I had to work out a new editing software that I'm never using again because it was really cretinous. Just to like overlay some form of picture, which I just overlaid literally like a screenshot of the call, mm. which because I'm lazy. Um, but you know, like literally, I'm, I'm a dinosaur when it comes to technology. <laughs> but that's alright. That's, that's okay. I, think it's a shame. I don't care. <laughs> YouTube, honestly, this is my mindset. YouTube start paying me, I will probably put the money that YouTube pays me into different youtube things, whether that's some form of nice paid-for editing software or probably a new camera at some point, a bit of lighting or something. YouTube pay me, then we'll talk about up in the quality. <laughs> Until then. Until fuck then. Fuck off. Fuck off. We're on a slow... Uh, decline? <laughs> <laughs> the way you said that made that yeah. so good. So... <laughs> I, was like, I was like, can I say we're on a slow incline? Oh, gosh. Maybe we'll call it a very fucking slow incline. So, the, so, the, so heading on to like the podcast, I, I want to know, is there, if I said to you, an episode that went out or after we recorded, you went, yeah, well, that wasn't great. Is there one that sticks out to you? Because I'm just looking through. Um, well, there was there, there's one that was quite recent. I couldn't tell you specifically what it okay. was. I, I think, not because of the content, I... I think it was I think it was the Pixar ranking. Yes. Where we, very just decide, well. where we just decided to eat Mackies throughout it. Yeah, oh, that was a. That's the Why problem. did we decide just to scrap the concept of that? And that's doing. That's on seventy three views. That's doing. Like, for, that's doing great. Yeah. Why did we decide to scrap? Because I don't like eating on camera. I feel yeah. so uncomfortable. We were like there were guests who just wouldn't talk because we were too busy scrapping our Big Mac. Like <laughs> it was such so a just, bad concept. I don't know why. Especially we did when we were about doing like a mad mukbang. I don't think we were, that was such an awful concept. Yeah. But like, even if we were going to do it, doing it while ranking something was even worse. Like if we did it with a waffle podcast, maybe mm. we could get away with it. But while ranking, I just hard, feel socially awkward eating yeah. on camera. But it was a great episode. But mm. like, I think other, other than the fact that we were eating, to it, I didn't eat a lot of my food. Oh, yeah. I had more burger left at the end than I did. What like there was yeah. What that was, other... That was, that was um, upsetting. Obviously, you know, because obviously, I think on average, over half of over half of them are what we describe as waffle episodes. Mm. And with a waffle episode, like, like it's weird. Then I'm not sure if this is good or bad. There are no... There are probably specific what moments from waffle episodes that will come to you and go, oh, that was class. I can't mm. pick out and go, oh, that specific waffle yeah, was think- class. I think there'll be times where we are struggling. There have been times I think we both are struggling at at like 30 30 minutes into a waffle episode. Like, we need to provide at least another 15 minutes of content here. Um, But then, yeah, there are some moments that we'll see, like, that is genuinely one of the funniest things that's happened. Like, for me, at you, like, some things are like, that's just genius stuff. And then, what things I obviously will go into a bit more depth, but ones I do want to give a massive shout out to, to are. All of the guest ones in one way or another. Guests, guests one we've class. done. It just 
it like elevates shout them. out Matt and Ben, yeah. shout out Katie. Obviously, Obviously uh, they don't need a fucking shout <laughs> out, but me, you, Parker, Jess has happened that's what, a great two, format. three yeah. times now, and that and, and good format. And that's great. Really, and that's what we want to do more of. Like, yeah, you know, is, is get more people on because it's always a good. It's just always a good laugh. Like there are moments in, in the Matt and Ben podcast that are like so fun. The moment we all stood yeah. up and applauded, and they're like, "What's going?" Like it was. Like it, Katie smashed it. Katie was amazing. It was. We we know we have other people that are up for it, so it's, it's just something we need to do. Yeah, we need to do more. Of, to be fair, another episode that we only did one of this format, but we need to do more is the outdoor podcast we did. On, Out, on outdoor campus. was great. Uh, again, if you haven't seen that one, please go. That was genuinely because I was doing this, going through top ten moments. Look, I went through every fucking episode. Just had a lot of life through. in that episode. But that was so. Fun. The fact we had like a little audience go in. Comments as people walk past, like it was. We need to do another pop on yeah. the side shit and just go for it because that That's was great. that was a lot, a lot of fun. Um, I, I can see it there. Uh, Spotify rap is just fun yeah. because it's both interesting and exposing. It just creates yeah. some great and moments. It, it's where you've got embarrassing words on there that you don't want to say, like your guilty pleasure, yeah. and it just makes you've got to back it because it's it's like that's that's the thing. That sounding wanky doing a podcast is some is. You know, sometimes a little window into your soul. Obviously, I'm not oh, yeah. giving everyone like a, a complete like. This is my life. Yeah, but like you know, <laughs> Ralph the dog. Right? <laughs> oh, this is my life. But we've <laughs> said on it, like, but yeah, we've said it before. That obviously, we're not as energetic on here, like as yeah. we are on our own channels. Yeah, I go to this one. Right, I need to be. I need, yeah, so this is a bit more chill. Fun. Like yes, I, this is still not hundred percent who I am if there's no camera on me. No, yes, I'm slightly I am. more outrageous if there's no camera. <laughs> <laughs> so like being more depressed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I, don't, I don't speak like this. So. <laughs> more, <laughs> I surprised, you might be surprised to know I don't make this many good funnies at the same rate. We kind of do. We kind, we, of, we kind of do. In the same room we kind of do. Just because we're so fucking great as you. Oh yeah, is. none of this is put on. We are just a funny comedian. Yeah, no, yeah. We're, just, we're just so funny. I don't know what to tell you. Um... Uh, there have been some moments that we, we the episode that we lost that was a bit of drama with it and then found it that was a good the Rubicon that <laughs> whole the whole Rubicon thing Rub- Rubicon is definitely something that's died now oh yeah so if you don't know throughout I'd say the first twenty episodes mm-hmm. a joke very quickly emerged that we like Rubicon Rubicon please sponsor <laughs> us yeah which they didn't which Wank us. but but then eventually. Through a competition that Jess entered on oh, our Twitter, yeah. we ended up thinking we were at least getting like a like a like a, like, like well, some they, stuff from. They sort of said to us, so we won, and then they DM'd us on Twitter going, "Oh, what's like what flavor do you like?" And I literally said, "Oh, a selection of like loads would be great." So I thought we're going to get a package with like little like four packs of loads yeah. of different. Or, no, no, we got a thirty-two pack or something of of, of manga Rubicon, <laughs> and it was like a fatty box. Like, we were expecting oh, to get a full video or a full podcast yeah. out of this. I lived off that shit and it, <laughs> for at least a month. And it was just... It was like <laughs> It was just 24 a pack of Rubicon. Like, if you, the shop, like, if you bulk buy a drink, you yeah. get, like, in the, like, the, the, wrap, like, the plastic wrap cover. It was that. But of 32 cans of fucking Mango Rubicon. And like, Which we said, Mango Rubicon is one of the best yeah. Rubicons. So Imagine if they just must have fucking liked you. Imagine got the 32 oh. lightgy cans, I probably would have just... I'm I glad both really of our minds went to lychee. Shit. Fucking hell. If you, get, if you like lychee, you're weird. I don't get it. <laughs> the other thing with lychee is you've got to like, fucking peel it and then it's like this weird fucking... You see, you see yeah, horrible. The texture of it is rank. As people will know, I'm weird with like sometimes little bits of like textured food. Am I autistic? <laughs> <laughs> Harry wrote the short way. <laughs> like, you, I should... Um, maybe I should do a tell... Because sometimes I... Like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like, <laughs> I have traits and I'm there like, am I? That's a great bad podcast. Oh, are we autistic? <laughs> we just both take an autism test. I uh, honestly, I, I think, you know, like, like, it's a struggle, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> uh, one of the things I can see that is like, like the biscuits. So it's like ranking things. Oh, and, that's which we feel for the, for that to be twenty two. The first yeah. time we ranked something. Was that the first? That was the first time we did, wasn't it? I'm I'm not sure we then you know from twenty three started ranking things every time. No. But like but that's early doors for us to go. You know what? Let's let's let's, let's, let's find a random share list and just rip the shit out of it. And I don't think that segment's going to die anytime soon. No, for you for great. you ranking fans out there, you bloody love it. I don't we know think that do. segment's ending. 
I think the bit that cemented it was when we did it with Katie. We did like ice lollies. That was so. That whole like twenty minutes segment was so funny. I, I don't. I don't think. I don't think it's going anywhere. I think moving. that's that's what because as we said, I reckon you know you look at the first like fifteen podcasts and like. To, to, right. This is what I think it is. Okay. So for the first what like six months, I'd say we were recording podcasts probably every two weeks, maybe. Yeah. And therefore, oh, we, good one. we just had more notes, like podcasts themselves. It'll be rare that they didn't reach an hour, mm. and it was all good. And then we started moving into the house, and we like just naturally, especially because also we have conversations generally every day. We live as with each well. other. We see each other every day. We're not going to have as much to say. So podcasts were starting to get a little bit stretched by the half hour mark, but I think not only has ranking shit. You know, giving us some fucking content, <laughs> but it's also they're usually once you record an episode, you look back and they're the funniest bit. Yeah, it's it gives us what like twenty minutes on average of content, and it's funny. It's bloody lovely. So we've got we've got tangents as we do. Um, look at that here. Whoa, this is this is oh, a million dreams. We do like videos. We, we need to. Which is still are. I feel like we should do more. Wait, sorry, 2.5k? Oh, it is, it is, yeah. No, it's got mental. So we have 2.5k on a reaction video on, on, on this channel. That's uh, incredible. Brilliant. Um, but I, I think we should do more videos. Yeah, Like, okay. just mouth specific, because they're always good. Uh, we did clips for a bit here, and that died. Clips just died because editing it's is admin. admin. Not end of the day, it's admin. I think what we've said is that if there is a genuine clip that just makes sense and the yeah. person who's editing it has a t- has the time to do it, then we'll do it. We don't want to force a clip. Like doing a clip every episode, is a, sometimes there isn't. Because if we talk about something for two minutes and it's really good, we can't put a two minute clip. Yeah. Like we have to have at least six, seven minutes of good like conversation to go. That could be a clip and. It's not going to do well. And it is also half hours admin to do it. So yeah. I'm and it sounds ranking, My we, half hours are very precious. Yeah. But if we're trying to sort of do this for our own yeah. shit and like uni work, like, I can't be bothered. The, cri- oh, the original Christmas special, that yeah. was an absolute... I, I think that's still has to win my favourite episode. I don't think there's an episode we've done since that I thought that was better than that. Like That, that first Christmas Comedy. special was like, so genius. For an episode that is literally two and a half hours long, and the fact that the quality is just it's just funny throughout. It, it, it's great. We we absolutely banged that. And I yeah. think it's because we did like presents, there were drinks, there were we yeah. we just it was great. It was an episode five that was. We pe- we peaked we too early. We we peaked too early. Wow. It's been downhill. It, it's gone <laughs> shit. <laughs> it's been We are awful. terrible. Um so <laughs> I can't think that was not that bad. Oh, that's, you know. a bit far, that's okay. Um yeah, so we looking through that you can see, we've it's weird to see how many we've done. Yeah, like it's can... like you say fifty, but then if we scroll through, like this is we this is a lot of our lives. It's both weird and not weird. But do, do, I genuinely feel like I will like, like you know give it twenty years or something. Like I never want that. Even if even if God forbid we stopped uploading on this channel, yeah. I never want it deleted. So in twenty it's... years, I'll just go back and just watch all our raw shit. Like <laughs> it's literally it's like it's almost like, it sounds wacky, but like a video. It's almost like video <laughs> diaries. Like you just, well, if I'm forty five. And YouTube has not been like gotten rid of yet. YouTube's still a thing. I'd be like, yeah, I'm just gonna whack on mediocre best episode forty two and go, what are we doing? Like it, it, it like it's because I, I, I was editing a video for my channel yesterday, and I was like, going, this will be here until I take it down mm. or until YouTube packs it in, which I don't think it, I don't see it doing that. Like so I can I see like, YouTube losing because 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 let's face it, obviously people will talk about TikTok for example, mm. but. I, I, I think the only reason YouTube would lose popularity is if another long form video. And if it does, like people, people just switch to that. <laughs> but, but even then, it would it would take a lot for YouTube just oh. to fully shut down. That's not, yeah, but it might lose popularity, but I don't think YouTube will ever, like as a website, will ever stop existing. Because mm. you've got to look, yeah, like so many people, celebrities on like TV shows are on there. I don't think it will. It will take a lot for it to disappear. But I thought. I could go back whenever I want to watch this shit we did ten years ago or sat on a sofa. Also, that's mental that just because you put Jesse Reed in the thumbnail, it got We should talk about this. There's some <laughs> sort of thing, I don't know why it is on our channel. I... If we put someone else that isn't me or James, it can literally just be Barker who's been on the podcast so many times. We put anyone else in the thumbnail and it does better. 
It's it's meant that it's like it's not. Like I know some off, people like, that know us in real life that might know Jesse Reed that wouldn't usually watch. I guess if maybe. they see Jesse, go oh Jesse was on here. But then I find it weird when the Mad Podcast, a Mad Podcast, has more views than than people that are subscribed. Yeah. So I'm there thinking, how are people finding this and actively not, wanting to click yeah. on it? If they're not subscribed, they've seen it. it must, yeah, it's. So whenever we get the chance to get someone else to sit in, even like Jesse sat in for ten seconds, yes, and then literally paused for a thumbnail shot. And he went because so I was like, I know it will, do, it will get us better views if you come and sit in for a bit. So if you see someone else in the thumbnail, that's why they might only be in there for five seconds, but it'll get us more views. So but I don't feel do guilty it. revealing that because anyone watching to this point isn't clicking on no. just because they see someone in the thumbnail. You just you love are, our band. You are the real OG. I want to kill myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh god! Right. Um, um, or also, I like, haven't seen a lot of these thumbnails. Shout out Parker. Parker has done us a lot. Of, but done a lot of good service on this Parker podcast, and I'd love that shit. to continue if he's, yeah. if he's up for these it. These are good. They're like the Reddit episodes Reddit we did. Get we Reddit need to do more of them. The Arm of the Arsehole was great. So those sort of Reddit ones we need to do more of. That was a short lived segment, wasn't it? The Mike and Sally mugs. Yeah. That we had for a bit and then binned off because we didn't really do drink segment anymore. Which is the problem. We still, still got our mugs. We still got them. I still have a cup of tea out of them every once in a while. Probably if they're awkward to drink out of. Especially hey, Sully. Oh. Sully is so awkward. The problem is you get a little bit of like the mic one that you just can't drink out of without tipping it all yeah, over your cause, face. Yeah, because they've got like a little lip hit. Oh God. It, like, the tea gets stuck out. Like, well, I can't drink out of this now. There's just some tea residue. I bloody love me <laughs> tea, tea residue. residue. Tea residue is my favourite kind of residue. If I know my residue, and you I'm like like it too. Too. Um, oh, I forget sometimes how long your hair it is. It is a candy bit long. I, was I forget it. sometimes that it just fucking it's it like a little lion mane. Made. But the problem is, right? It's is that amazing? It can tie up, yeah. but not fully yet. So it's like in between. Yeah. And uh, once it gets to the point where I can actually tie it up, I'll be fine. But like, I can tie it up, but the size that tie it probably is pissing me off. I need to go a bit more. It'll be mm. fine. It's a nightmare. Uh, do you want to watch Ted and the I would bloody love to! Uh, I'm going to go and get some earphones. Do you have earphones? Wide earphones? I do, or yeah. Or earphones, I don't know which ones. Just so we can audio and I'll sync it up with the next clip. Yeah. Uh, James, hello, right, right. So we have got uh, top 10 mad moments from the first 50 episodes. This is this, this, this looks professional. Uh, I was going to put a little voice over this bit of me saying well, but I, I forgot. So. Fair enough. Uh, also, this this compilation will go up as a video on the channel. So if you can watch it any time so you like. <laughs> whenever you want a little pick-me-up, you can just watch the uh, top ten moments. So I was going to do a nice little... That's all right. Six you pause it. Just with it, guys. I know. Get the original Hulk back. What was his name? Give fucking Lou Ferrigno in. <laughs> I did not mean Lou. <laughs> did you not? Did you mean fucking... I meant the... Guy what I love about this that Batman fan is... Yeah. Ferrigno jumps. The it's that like one. Eric Bannon jumps. I don't know why I was going to say Ferrigno. Right. I didn't really know why I was At the time, I was completely baffled. I was going to get away with it. Oh, no, you shouldn't. Why do I keep saying, keep saying Ferrigno? It's really annoying that I keep saying... Faringo. The thing that makes it clear is just watching Fab just head go. <laughs> He's so confused. Go. He's absolutely baffled. <laughs> it opens and Lou so Faringo jumps. You know who Lou Faringo is? <laughs> He's <laughs> got it. Jumps <laughs> That was oh, I, I love I said the original Hog and you went, what, Lou Faringo? <laughs> not Lou Faringo. It's so infuriating. <laughs> oh, God. I got <laughs> it. This whole debate, I'm sure everyone's watching this knows, are there more doors or wheels in the world? A wheel! That's not a wheel! <laughs> You're a cunt! You're a twat! Fuck <laughs> off it, it's a wheel! Oh. It is a wheel! You're, you're a piece of shit. Oh, fuck <laughs> off! <laughs> fuck off then! The best thing about that, right? The best thing about that. Is that is some great acting, is that kids. <laughs> we, we spoke to Katie, who didn't know it was staged. <laughs> Katie <laughs> thought that was real. Have I told you this? Because well, wasn't that on April Fool's Day we uploaded that? Yeah, that was, that was point. It was uploaded on April Fool's. We thought, oh, let's do a little funny. Oh, Doors versus Wheels is a big thing. Let's pretend yeah. we've got a massive falling out. Katie did not know that was staged. So let's go over here. That was completely staged. Yeah, it was April Fool's Day. But yeah, Katie was like, yes, because I'm definitely that. <laughs> yeah, I'm really that fucking passionate. Fucking Doors versus like, Wheels. I don't know how she just didn't. I was like, it's absolutely mental. Well, was, we went into that. No rehearsal. No. 
prior editing. Yeah, we we it. But we banged it. We banged it. And that, that was right at the end of the episode as well. Yeah. So like we we had we kept that. That was that was it built acting. I was gonna try because that lasted about ten minutes. So I can't keep the whole ten minutes no. in. That whole debate lasted about ten minutes. So on the lap for I had to put this in. There is just one thing I, I need. I don't care about the presents underneath Christmas tree. <laughs> Here's the key change, it's great. Yeah. I just oh. want to <coughs> Turn to camera, fiddling with the mic for some reason. Oh, then you could. <laughs> it is like on it. Never know. I love the jump. Make it's my great, wish camera. come true. <laughs> So All I want for <laughs> You <laughs> fucked it. Is you it's good. It's great, it's good. That it's is good. iconic, as you can tell, vocally. <laughs> I am like Andrew, Mr. Lloyd Webber. <laughs> Gary in contact. <laughs> Gary in contact. Yeah. Very nice. <laughs> Gary in contact. <laughs> Gary in contact. That's a good word for song. <laughs> no. Gary in contact. Mr. Andrew Lloyd oh. Webber. Gary in contact. Mr. Oh, really? Andrew <laughs> Lloyd Webber. I was not expecting that. Get up. Well, then we know what's really coming. Like in the, we know what's coming in the top moments for the first hundred episodes. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> like Andrew Lloyd Webber. Gary in contact. This oh. movie is underrated. I didn't know what to put this in, but I, th okay. I thought it was quite underrated. 19 is what's it? I think you have to be about four years I'll old say, unless or be Jessalyn. <laughs> so like, what's it? No, literally. Right, you either have to it's be so 12 childish. or have the mental age of a 12 year old to actually enjoy And you just get them all over your fingers. It's not practical. No, it's of it, you get to lick it off. I'm not a child, I don't want to be my sodding fingers Honestly. after a crisp. Um, right, I don't know how this has gone to 18 okay. of everyone's Good. popular crisps, <laughs> but scampy fries. I've never even heard, what the fuck a is a scampy, scampy fries? Crisp? Crisp? I've this whole no, they're not. We're, we're, getting, we're, we're just talking about what yeah. is a scampy fries? Because that's what it is. What? People shouting out what's a scam, like it's a fish flavoured crisp. This is what we need to do more of these. What else can we do? Uh, knickknacks. Wait, sorry, I didn't realise that a flavour of knickknacks was nice and spicy. That's it. Nice and spicy. Right, we've got a spicy crisp. What are we going? Nice and spicy. Nice and spicy. Oh god! Yeah, we, we have to. I was like, we don't need cat and dog no. Like, what is the point? Because like, I thought the last well, one is going to really sum up that. Yeah, so going back to it doesn't help us at all. But why are we so arrogant to go? These animals need different years. I, 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 what is the science I behind that by dog and cat years? I've never actually thought about it, but I'm now you've said it. I'm thinking. <laughs> Why do they exist? It makes no fucking sense. I, don't I really am a little bit. Well, made. Massive debate of what are cat years. Like, like, yeah, like, like, like how many cat there. years and dog years, and why yeah. do they care? But it doesn't matter, does it? Like, the first year's 15. How does. How do we know this? I'm sorry. Because my question is if they're saying. <laughs> 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 seven years old, so in human years, that's like 95. <laughs> They don't have different years to us, they just have a shorter life expectancy. I'm sorry, my cat is two, not fucking 35. Literally, like, <laughs> what do you... The, like, it doesn't make sense. Don't laugh at your own joke, it makes you feel really, really interesting. Hang on, sorry, yeah, the second... Probably. Wait, what? The first year is 15, second cat's nine, <laughs> and then four. How do we know what, what do you does mean? that mean? Wait, so time just decides to shrink in a cat's... The math, oh, the, the no. maths doesn't make sense. The, I, I, don't, I, I, don't, I, I will stand by that point. That why, still are we, me. why are we giving dog? Because uh, right, I, I don't want to get rolled up again. But it is like if you're saying a dog dies at a, a, a natural extent. I don't know how long dogs live. Say they live till ten. That thing going okay, but for a human that's like seventy. No, they just have a shorter no. life expectancy than we. They don't have years different work. years. The Earth doesn't go. Oh, it's a dog. Hang on, let me fucking slow down. The, it's it's also this whole right. For your first year, you live till you, you live longer yeah, than every like, other year. Yeah, the first year is equivalent to fifteen, and then every other year is nine. What? It's Why? still a year, dickhead. Just, just, just don't be so dead. Just, just, just measure the years. Yeah, <laughs> five hundred twenty-five thousand six hundred. Years are years are years. As Russell T Davies once wrote. Yeah, oh god. <laughs> now this this is an iconic. Oil yeah. on pizza. What? The I feel fuck like this. Yeah. Right, uh, <laughs> don't even start.
<laughs> right. I knew I'd get I'm so glad you said this. I knew this. I'd get Oh my god. This. Right. So, every time. <laughs> when I was younger, I say younger, when I was younger, I'm just bloody loving it. And get like exactly. from them. Exactly. They, they do these like, you can make your own thing. <laughs> exactly. It's exactly. the like, making love yeah, to the pasty that really works. Chili the oil way. on the pizza. And I look, I'd be like, what's it? They'd be like, oil on your pizza? I was like, oil on my pizza? <laughs> so, what do you mean? <laughs> I like, no, I don't want oil. My mum would be like, oh, chili oil, please. It's like, literally. I'm like, why are you putting oil on your pizza? It's like going. Pizza is quite pasty as it is. Yes. Fucking put oil on it. Sorry, I'd love some li extra liquid on my. Like, like, what are you doing? Fucking dousing it in fucking sparkling water. Yeah. Like, what? <laughs> oh, I can't even. What? Yeah. Why do you. Your sorry, best I'm joke. Like a strawberry flavoured pizza. So I'm just put some fucking strawberry Volvic on it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's so out of pocket. I have not seen that in a, in a year. It's so out of pocket. <laughs> so that's also the only podcast we ever filmed that my old cat. I love it. Great. I got it. I don't want to put on a fucking pizza. No. I quite want to taste the chilli. I don't want to put fucking chilli on a pizza. Garlic oil. No. Just get some garlic mayo dip, you silly twat. You don't need to put oil on it. Just put some fucking garlic on there. Just put some fucking chilli on there. Here's the idea. Garlic or chilli flakes. Whoa, whoa, who the fucking thunk it? It's the same timing of that. so good. That was great. Now, are we going to get the top three? I don't know what that was. You have to douse it in greasy oil, you use. Twats. Oil on pizza fucks me up. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> this is oh, oh yeah. <laughs> no, I know what you're doing! <laughs> Don't you fucking dare if you see what I think he's gonna do. What's happening? Oh, I thought he was gonna do something I else. I thought you were gonna do something different. I thought he was Soon. gonna do the same thing. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you're not even originally gonna do the rocks that we gave you the idea. No! No! Basically, just uh, for context, um, we have a croc agenda. No, we have a, fuck, yeah, no. croc agenda. Uh, so I've the area of the toilet. So in the toilet, what the fuck is wrong with you? you in the what? bowl, isn't it? You slag. <laughs> <laughs> it's just it's chaos. Like, get off my bed, bitch. No, James, I'm so stressed. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, we missed. We missed. We missed. <laughs> Phew. Come on. Come on, Jess. For the content. It's pure chaos. For the content. For the video crevasse channel. Come on. I'm bringing that up. I love that it turned into a blind half way through. For the video crevasse channel. It's just. Hey. For the content. Come on. Fuck off. For the content, Jess. Jess. Jess, for the content. For the content. We're like, come on. I hope you could talk. It's just the sound of the shot of just seeing two crocs on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> it's great to look at the zoom in really we well. Me, yeah. Yeah. Anyway. Right, we're getting into top three. What moments do you want to see in the top three? I think we'll let you down here. Let's face it. Oh shit, what, what the fuck? Like, what the fuck? It's gonna be there. Um, Do we actually have that good of a podcast? I don't know. Well, like cock? I never tennis feast. Again, that's not a good one. No, it isn't his pog's edition. <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> <laughs> it's a whole damn meal. <laughs> <laughs> it's your food. Madeline McCann is 
just sat doing an episode of media over a bed. <laughs> it would be great. And he's a trans guy. <laughs> Thinks he can twat a crocodile. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. Guys. This is really the really fucking is. police reports on that. We are actually really funny. Imagine if a cat has been found. And he's a trans. trans. He's a trans man. <laughs> on an episode of the media. Sorry, the podcast. <laughs> Can you see the Sun newspaper headlines? <laughs> Madeline McCann found he's now a man. <laughs> Madeline McCann! Parker's <laughs> 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 oh. no. the funniest yeah. member of Matt. I can't believe yeah. Parker's actually the funniest member of Matt. That's really offensive. <laughs> the past two have both been Parker. It's one for to hold down here. It's, it's where they bark at. <laughs> oh, it's so good. We both know what that was. We know what it is, it's great, Mad. it's great. Oh my god, mud. Here we go. <laughs> so excited. We know what it is. Buzz it, black cherry. Black cherry or strawberry. Well, Come on. But black cherry and raspberry. I don't think I've ever had anything that's black cherry. You know, it's like, is it like Morello cherry ones? You can, oh, fuck, oh, fucking, what the fucking bastard. <laughs> <laughs> so good. It's great, it, it, It's the <laughs> progression of it. It's so good. Oh, fucking what the fuck? It's the little. Yeah, because initially you're like, oh, what the fuck? Oh, what the fuck? It's, 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 you, you can see it slightly bubbling the drink as well. So it? it goes a little bit. You're like, I think I can contain this. Oh, then, oh fucking what the fucking bastard. It's the afterthought, bro. It's great content. <laughs> Apologies for my language there, guys. Um, <laughs> We're three minutes in and it's gone. I just to... wanted to talk about a litre bottle of sparkling Morello cherry drink. <laughs> now I've got Rubicon Black Cherry Raspberry Sparkling Spring Water with fruit juice all over my floor. <laughs> anyway, Fraser, it tastes nice. It's not right. It's not even that great. It's all right. That tastes quite nice. I'm <laughs> oh my god. We are really funny. Eh? Viva la mediocre. What we've learned is that we are actually yeah. oh, going to be shot there. Is. Enjoy that, kids. <laughs> That's going to be screenshot. Uh, oh, we just learned that we're just, we are we, funny. We are class. Oh my god. We are god. bloody oh god. Oh god. It's <laughs> oh, 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 thank you very much. Cheers. Oh. Mediocre um, best. But that will be, at some point, after this podcast goes out, uploaded as a... Like, as a wee clip. Have yes. a watch. Have so a gander. Watch anytime you want to feel have a bit of joy in your life. Bloody Newfoundland. Mm. Oh, I was a bit knackered after watching that. No, that was a bit like... It was odd. But it's nice to be like with lots of varying lengths of beard. Yeah, and hair to be fair. Oh god. Uh, oh no, are we... We uh, we might have to do an episode of Mad Me we'll and Shaven. Just for, just for their entertainment and nothing else. Uh, basically, uh, so... Uh, a few, uh, uh, this was nearly a month ago now, it feels like. There was a workshop we had to do as part of uni. We didn't have to do it, but I fancied it. Mm. So basically working with first years, doing some like audition kind of stuff. And then they were picking actors to do their first year little day shoot films. So I got picked to do a couple of them, banging. Uh, don't, I haven't heard anything for a while. Then I get asked to do a costume thing. And I go in thinking it's just costume fitting for one of them. Turns out it isn't even actually a fucking costume fitting, it's just measuring me. So I'm just there, stood there like a fat cunt, just there like getting measured because I'm overweight. Oh. Uh, <laughs> and then, then someone else comes in and goes, oh yeah, you're the guy we need from, can we just do the sa- these two at the same time? Just because obviously, you know, I'm, you're doing my film as well. I'm like, yes, sure. sound. I don't have to come back to this shithole. <laughs> Thank fuck. Uh, no, it's actually really nice in there. What is the uh, beautiful little building. Um, oh God. And then, and then I'd be at the end. And she was like, "Oh yeah, uh, for mine, by the way, uh, we're going to need you to shave uh, because you're playing a fourteen-year-old." Which was this for? Uh, my friend. My friend. Uh, so, are you still doing a, not a, a, a different version of? I think maybe. It's all a bit confusing. It's all a bit baffling. It's all it's all over the place. It's not very organised. So apparently, I'm playing a fourteen year old. So apparently, I'm the casting type of a fucking fourteen year old, uh, and I've got to be clean shaven. Uh, it's going to be very upset. The thing is, if I knew that was the case to begin with, I'd have just gone nah. Mm. I'm so you're too far in now. 
I'm t- I like, like I think I th- like we're like a couple of weeks away from shooting. I'm there. Like I don't want to just completely fuck their plans. Yeah, maybe start off, again. Gonna... I would just look a bit of a cunt. I think. Oh, you're gonna have to. So you're I'm, gonna I'm gonna with you. Yeah, I've got it. And I'm gonna. I've, I've said. I've said this. Part of I'm it. gonna make it part of a transition or like a. Yes. Uh, you, you know, do do something hot comedian. If you've got to do it. You may as well get content out of it. Yeah, might as well use it. Oh, can walk, oh. Get some. Might try and get some like professional headshots with it because obviously I'm not sure when the next time I get clean shaven is. So if I need to put myself off like clean shaven rolls, True. it's a good shout. So um, cause well, I need to get some headshots with the beard anyway. So I need to. Yeah, I, I, need to get some I might. I might. There's a couple of guys that keep floating around on Instagram, so I might go. Yeah. Yo, can I do a couple of different sessions? One with hair and one without. Because mm. that's how hair works. works. That is. That is. But no, it's, it's it's gonna be it's gonna be strange. The problem is right. Uh, I don't value myself much. <laughs> well, uh, I, I, you know, I don't think I am the best looking human being. I can't lie. But the problem is, I know my beard's kind of class. Mm. I know it's just kind of good. So losing it is gonna be like losing a child. Is it? Oh God! It is gonna. It's gonna look really strange. Yeah, it'd be it's interesting. Just... It'd be good enough. Mm. It'd be good funny, wouldn't it? No, well, no, I, I just don't know, I can't, really I, can't I can't, I can't lose it! I'm going to look shit! <laughs> oh, I will look, I will yeah. look, I will look kind of mad. It'll be interesting. It's kind of, it's kind of El Depresso. How's, 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 how's Meta Moon going I'll be now? honest, it's not growing on me. It's gotten worse as I keep drinking it. But that's how I'm feeling anyway. The problem is it's perfectly drinkable. Like, I'm there, like, I, I don't, I really don't mind I don't mind drinking, but it, it's... I take, I take... I enjoyed it more at the start than I am now. I take back my statement, blue raspberry is better. This is the oh, worst yeah. prime I've yeah. had. I reckon it'll get beaten by grape, because fucking hell, grape oh, flavour. Grape, it's so American grape flavor. I don't, I don't even, th- I think it's so, like, because obviously, you know, you see, the, the ones that mainly get sold, obviously, Asda, Asda is, for, from, what I, from what I can always seem to be seeing, it's lemon lime gets sold, blue raspberry gets sold quite a lot, ice pop seems to get sold quite a lot, so it's surprising. How have you missed ice pop? And land on it, um, and then obviously occasionally you'll get weird ones like this through. Yeah. You, the thing yeah, is, I loads of this. I was baffled. I don't think we'll see orange or grape for a while, just because we, because I don't think I've ever seen unless Sainsbury's comes in clutch. That's the thing. I might just we might just pop the Sainsbury's occasionally to have a look. Pop that today. Pop that today for a bit of fun. Do a pop yeah, that to spot Sainsbury's. Because that's the place we got the um, tropical in the KSI one. Because we walked in there, yeah. a massive thing of it, and this was a, it wasn't even early. It was like three o'clock. Mm. We looked in there, and it fully stopped. So it's. Yeah, so we could go there and see if they've got. They did have. What other ones did they have? Because the ones they had were lemon lime, blue raspberry, KSI, and we picked up our first tropical fruit, ah, which right. we need to so try next time. So what we need now is grape, grape, ice orange, pop, and ice orange. Pop. Yeah, because I'm ice pop. I'm excited for. I would have orange. been more excited for orange had we not just tried the KSI. Which yeah, orange. I don't I don't know how it can taste mm. that dressing. Grape is going to be awful. Yeah, I'm not going to I don't like grape flavour. I like grape. I'm not too excited for Ice Pop, to be fair. I'm more, ex- I'm more excited now for, to try an energy drink version. Or, yeah. or to be fair, because I, I know the strawberry watermelon one came out in the US. Okay. But I'm not sure if the strawberry watermelon has come out to the UK yet. It's yeah, bloody nice. I don't mind like a strawberry watermelon. No, no, no. Yeah, refreshing. I'd, I'd quite like to try an energy drink version. Yeah, so that I quite like nice. energy. That would be gross. Mmm. Oh, I'm a bit back in that Been an intense week, I it? it has been an intense fucking week. Life's, life's happening. Um, uni's still a bit naff. It is, I'm afraid. I don't know what to tell you. <sighs> yeah. We done? I think so. I don't think there's anything else. What are we up? 20... Oh, yeah, we've got plenty of content. Yeah, banging. I think... That's that's the thing. We said initially this could be a checker point for Mavic. It hasn't been. Um, but, 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 you know, I feel like... Let's let's get to 100 and then we'll talk about all that shit. Yeah, because we, 50 isn't a real milestone, yeah. but I mean, for, for our mm. silly, stupid little podcast, it kind, kind of is. is. And, uh, and we know, because obviously we've, we've, we've started the upload schedule for a while now, and that's class, mm-hmm. so... Well, more on it. There has been... So yeah. it's been a few days late sometimes, but, but it's been there's been a consistent. Well, a, you, you've had one a week, yeah. whether they've been they've been seven days apart. You've had you've had enough for one a week. And too far, I put my hands up most most of the times. It's my fault. I can't lie. I can't lie because uh, I'm idle. Uh, but 
Yeah, so get, give it, get, to, get us to 100 and then we'll 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 talk all that shit for it. Yeah, him. and subscribe. Subscribe. Because a lot of... We, we get more views than subscribers. Yeah. What's that about? On so, so, on so. On, on so. Yeah. And comment. Yes, comment. Oh, and uh, so, someone actually shouted us out on Twitter the other week. Uh, shout out Morgan. I love you, Morgan. Oh, you thanks. In what way? Uh... Well, we know each other from like Doctor Who YouTube, nice. uh, and he and he he, he he tweeted out. He did put a URL in though. Put a URL in next time, <laughs> Morgan. Thank you, Morgan. Thank, thank you, Morgan. Thank Morgan. You're your class. <laughs> uh, he's gonna come on Never Eat Pears and talk about Flux, but he likes Flux. Oh, oh. so it's gonna be a little bit of a fist but I can't. A bit that's girl. that's the problem. I'll probably let him because I, I love I love Morgan. So yeah, I'm gonna, you got, I'm gonna like, let him. Yeah, you got to concede a few points to him. Yeah, I've got it. Even if I disagree, with even if Flux is not good content. <laughs> Well, thank you. Flux is bad, unlike this podcast, so you should subscribe. So you should subscribe. So you should subscribe. The Wurzels are back on the map podcast, and you should subscribe. Black clap. I might, I might do like a Wurzel segment each week, and maybe we should make, make a new Wurzel segment. We've set, this is a little post amble. We've got pre amble, this oh. is post amble. Uh, I did, we expect we should do a Wurzels tribute band. We should! We'd be so good. Why don't we do it? Why don't we do it? Oh, it we would be fucking uh, car soon. Cornish Bank, I should just do it. get Matt and Ben to play back in. Exactly. <laughs> it would be class. Fucking hell. We would fucking smash it. Because we are class. I said class twice. Fucked. <laughs>